Question 6. What do you notice about the coordinates on y-axis? That is very interesting, right? So I'll prefer you to write down the coordinates of points on y-axis and then answer the question. Okay? Uh, here is my solution. So what are the points on y-axis? Can you tell me that? Well, y-axis is always this vertical axis. Do you see that y-axis? There are arrows on this side also. It moves in both x and y x-axis and y-axis move in both the directions, right? y-axis moves vertically up and vertically down. x-axis moves horizontally right and horizontally left, okay? Now, what are the coordinates on the y-axis? C and D, do you see that? So we have C and D on y-axis. Can you write down their coordinates or the ordered pair of C and ordered pair of, oh, sorry, not D, H, or sorry, C and H. Can you write down the ordered pairs of C and H? Well, C is 0 for x value because you don't move left or right, but you move up 1, 2, 3. So 0 for x and 3 for y. How about H? 0 for x and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 down. So 0 and minus 5 since you move 5 down. Correct? Now what do you notice? You notice that x coordinate is same for them. Right? The horizontal x coordinate is same. Do you see? Which is 0. So points on y axis will always have x equals to 0. x equals to 0 for points on y-axis. Can you tell me about the points on x-axis? Like the one we have here, the point is 5, 0, right? Y point is 0. So the points on x-axis will have y value 0 or the vertical coordinate 0, okay?